Fuel is now 1,065 Naira per liter, and some people still think I am the problem in this country, says Bobriski. Nobody is saying you are a problem in the country, but you are a problem to yourself and to other people. You are a man acting like a woman, so you are a problem. You are one of the problems that we have in this country apart from the fuel. Now to the news in full. Bobriski said, fuel is now 1,065 Naira per liter and some people still think he is the problem, he or she, in this country. He said, with the current increment in the price of fuel, which now sells for 1,065 Naira per liter, some people still think that he is the problem in the country. Well, you are one of the problems we are facing because you are not a good example for children in the society. You are not a good example for people as a whole. You are a man. You are behaving like a woman. You were sent to the jail, but you did not even go to jail. You, you bailed your way through so that they will put you in a special apartment. So, you are one of the problems that we have in this country. Because if you are acting like that, because you think that this country does not have a law, that is why you are doing anything that you like. And you know that such attitude that you are behaving, the way you are behaving is not allowed in our, in our country. But yet you keep doing it. So apart from the fuel price, you are also one of the problems that we have in this country. Sammy said, Mr. Man, you are one of the problems. Exactly. You are one of the problems that we have in our country. Kelvin Bryan said, but brisky is a disease to the society. Akilo Tommy said, look at this she man or man she. Only those who are fooling around get your time. You don't even exist. Doctors have given you attention. People get your time now. Wow, Things you are one of the problems that we have. You, 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 are, you are a menace to, to the society with everything that you are doing. You are, you are a complete menace. So you are one of the one of the problems. Morganigo said the time they are using to drag their fellow citizens. Why not use the opportunity to drag the federal government hardship? As they are dragging the um, Babriski, they are also dragging the federal government. So let everybody be dragged at the same time. Every problem that we have in this country, let them be dragged concurrently. It is you said, we don't have a problem that you are gay. Be gay for yourself. But you go around polluting, polluting young minds with your lies and deceit and poor lifestyle choices. You just can't keep quiet and fun your packages. You became an influencer of bad choices and deceit, turning good boys and girls to wish they were you. Exactly. Exactly. People thinking that, oh, this thing that he is doing is getting money from it, influencing people, lying, living fake lifestyle, saying he, ha he has also amount, he has this, he has that. Meanwhile, he does not have anything. But he is influencing people to, to want to be like him. Making them want to say, oh, I want to be like Bob Risky because, oh, he's cashing out, he's making money. Meanwhile, you are just living a fake life. So you are one of our problems. It's that said, oh, what did you expect? Buhari was the president and petroleum minister. Him, Tunubu is the same and Nigerians are keeping quiet. NLC and TUC only make noise and can't bite. If a person steals a little thing, police authority will arrest, but politicians are having a few days with our own commonwealth. Hmm, this life, no balance at all. No balance, so these people are just there, stealing money, making life difficult for everybody. But God will catch them very soon. Allah will you say, Allah me says, you are not the major problem, but you are part of the problem. Your existence is polluting the life of our youth. Most of them believe you are doing the right thing, which they follow, and what you are doing is forbidden in the eyes of God. You know when God is annoyed with a nation, things will not be as it is supposed to be. So Bob Risky, you are part of our problem. Yes. And James buttress is point, the point that says, you nail it very well. Righteousness exalts a nation. Baba said, what concern you if it is a man or a woman? Are you guys his God that will judge? We are not judging him. We are, not, we are just telling him to do the right thing. You know that what you are doing is not good. Even if you want to do it, do it in your own side. Don't come and start influencing people to be like you. You know you are doing this thing for your hustle. You are doing it to make money. But does that make it right? No, it is not right. 
is not right. You're influencing young people to think that, oh, they can easily make money. And some of them, when they say that, oh, what you are doing is not working out for them, they resort to rituals. They resort to killing people just to make money. They want to make money by all means. You see young children of 15, 16, 17, 18, looking for money by all means just because they feel that, oh, this person is making money, so me too, I can make money. Meanwhile, the way you are making mo your money, it is illegal. It is not right. It is not the right way to go. Bolanle Hussein says, we all know that, but Brisky is a man and there is nothing he can do to change his gender. However, people should get off his case and call out NMPPC, independent marketers and oil cabbers before they ruin this country. Of course, we, we call them out, we are calling them out, but what power does a common Nigerian have? If you call them out and call them out, will they still do something? No, they would not. They will not. These people are wicked. Yeah, here Osman said, you are part of it. Being part of the kingdom of darkness is being part of the problem. We are going through, we are going through in this mother earth. Yes, you are part of the problem, oh, Babiski. You are very, you are a very core, cogent part of the problem. This is not the way God created you. You can still give your life to Christ and make a U-turn to him. I hope he listens. Somebody would have even thought that as he went to jail and came back, he would come back and rebrand himself. He would come back and become the person that he is. But he still came back and started doing the rubbish that he was arrested for. That man is just... I don't understand him. Everybody would thought, thought that, oh, if Bobbisi comes back from prison, he would turn back to a man. He would behave himself. He will start living the lifestyle that he's supposed to be living on a normal day. But no, he didn't do that. So as when he even came out, we started hearing that he did not even go to jail like, he, like they announced. He was put in a special place. Just imagine the, the kind of things that is going on in our country. Roland Jamie says, you are not the problem, but the people that are responsible for our problems are your friends with benefit exactly because see too he has said it that the politicians they are carrying him they are doing this they are doing that the kind of evil the kind of darkness the kind of bad things that we are doing in this country is enough for god to be angry with us in this country and i won't be surprised if it is god that is angry with this country if god was acting the way he was acting in old testament he would have cleared this country off since a very long time because we are doing so much evil in this country. The fair prices should be should be decreased. And also, Bobrisky, you are part of our problem. Try to maintain your lane or change your ways. God be with you. My listeners, over to you. Leave your thoughts in the comment section. Do not forget to like, to share, and to subscribe. Thank you for listening. See you some other time. Bye.